Hey guys, Ralph here. Welcome to True Power Save the Planet here on Thrilling Thursday. I'm doing another one. I was just upstairs about to call it a day. It's just about four o'clock. And um, I saw this uh, news clip. Bryson DeChambeau, golfer Bryson DeChambeau, needs surgery on his hand. The hanate bone in his hand. Now, not hating on Bryson DeChambeau. I, quite frankly, I feel bad for him. Um... <clears throat> I think it's pathetic what he did to himself. Um, but with that said, I did a video months ago, if not a year ago, I did a couple on him. And he is so blatantly roided up. I mean, he's just so blatantly roided up in a profession, a sport, that doesn't require this. It's not like he's playing professional football. It's not like he's playing, he's, you know, in the WWE. It's not like he's an MMA fighter. He's playing golf. And, you know, Justin Thomas, Colin Mar Mar Marikawa, I mean, they're this big, dripping wet, and they're, you know, it's, it's just dumb. It's just dumb. But with that said, I called it. I called it. I said within it, he will be hurt. Now, I said his wrist, and I said his, either his wrist or his back, okay? It was his hand. I'm still taking credit for it. <laughs> I don't care. I'm still taking credit for calling, calling the injury. Now, uh, again, he's just so blatantly juiced. Juiced, I mean, he gained 50 pounds in one off season. He said it was all muscles and peanut butter sandwiches. This is the dumbest diet in the history of dumb. And um, again, it sounds like I'm mad at him, and I'm not. I don't care about him one way or the other. I really and truly don't. But it's just moronic what these people are doing to their bodies. They have no idea what they're doing, and they're being led around the nose by trainers that they're paying exorbitant amounts of money that's just getting them hurt. Now, steroids, no matter what you are doing, guys, steroids will take you places you wouldn't normally go. I give you that. You're not going to get there on fruits and vegetables. You do fruits and vegetables and steroids, and then you really got something, okay? But steroids take you places where you wouldn't normally go. And I'm going to go out on a limb here. Steroids take you places you shouldn't go. So in other words, you get on the roids, guys, and you start doing things that you wouldn't normally do, but your body isn't equipped to do those things long term. In Bryson DeChambeau's case, he, you know, was just absolutely maniacally uh, thinking about uh, club head speed, 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 and he did anything to swing harder and harder and harder, and he hurt his hand. How do I know that's steroids? Well, he is on roids. There's just no question about it. Now, why is that um, injury? Specifically on roids. Well, let me ask you a question. Let's talk about the greatest golfers that ever lived. Okay, Tiger was a roid head, so we're going to take him out of there. He's just a mess. Bryson DeChambeau isn't close. He isn't even close to being one of the greatest players of all time. He's not even one of the best players of his generation. He's like 20th in the world golf rankings. He's just uh, yesterday's news. But let's just go to the greatest ones of all time. Let's start with Jack Nicklaus. We'll go to Arnold Palmer. We'll go to Lee Trevino. We'll go to um, um, Bobby Jones. We'll go to Ben Hogan. We'll go to Sam Snead. Okay? Out of all those great players with all those major championships between them, Gary Player is another one, how many times did any of them have hand surgery? Not once. It's the hand ate bone in his hand that it just snapped. Now, guys, again, at some point, you have to use your head. And I, I guess that's the problem. Their, their head isn't very bright. He's just not a bright guy. Uh, he seems like a nice enough guy. Again, and again, I'm not hating on him. I, I, I don't care one way or the other. But guys, roids, if you're going to be in certain professions, you almost have to do them to succeed. Unfortunately... I just named a few before that. Baseball is chuck full of roids. Um, but the roid guys in baseball are all hurt, and they're not necessarily succeeding like uh, you think they might. Barry Bonds took 
uh, several years ago, took a, an extraordinary physical talent and added Roy's to it and went the next level. Alex Rodriguez is another one. But all these mediocre baseball players are all juiced up and they're, 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 they're basically they just end up mediocre baseball players with big muscles. And that's what happened to DeChambeau. He does not have world-class skills. And uh, he juiced up to try to hit the ball farther, which, ha which worked, which worked. And uh, the last time he won a uh, tournament was a couple years ago, the U.S. Open, which uh, he did it on roids. He hasn't won a darn thing since, and now he's hurt. So I hate to say I told you so, but I told you so. Anyway, eat and drink fruits and vegetables and live your life with true power. Not the fake stuff, true power. And Durian Rider and all you guys, you should stay away from the roids. Anyway, have a great Easter. Love you all. Well.